What is up guys, welcome back to another video. Right, so today what we've got is the perfect white t-shirt, trying to find the perfect white t-shirt. We've got loads of different brands to go through. We've got nine t-shirts in total. We've got brands like Ralph Lauren, Tommy Hilfiger, Lylan Scott, and then like low rent brands like Bershka, ASOS. Do you know what I mean? So I'm gonna link all the t-shirts in the description, but I thought it'd be interesting to see what the comparison is like from like a six quid t-shirt to a 45 quid t-shirt. So we're gonna go in price order. This is the lowest, going all the way up to the highest, and they're all in a size large as well. But if you do enjoy the video, guys, don't forget to drop it a like, subscribe to the channel if you've not already, and press the little bell notification just to keep up to date on all the videos. But yeah, let's start trying them on, see what they're actually like. All right, so the first t-shirt we've got is the cheapest one. It's from ASOS. It's an organic, regular fit t-shirt, size large, like I said. So my measurements for reference are I'm six foot two and about 190 pounds, which is about 87 kilos. All right, guys, so six pounds, ASOS design, organic tee. The only problem I have with ASOS t-shirts is, you see this shoulder bit here? On literally every t-shirt, it has this wrinkly, creasy bit. It's just every kind of t-shirt, no matter if it's like slim fit, muscle fit, normal, regular fit, they always have it. It's very strange, you need to sort out the designs, but apart from that, it's actually a very good t-shirt. Like the length is good, I like the quality, the quality is quite nice, it's quite nice and thick, and for six quid, can't really go wrong. This collar bit is quite high as well, so it's quite thick. It's a bit like a, a roll neck. But I do quite like it, it's pretty nice, but... Right, let's move on to the next one. Alright guys, second t-shirt is from Bershka. This is 7 99 and as you can see, it's a lot more of a tighter fit, so... This is definitely kind of like a muscle fit. It's got more of a scooped neck, so... A lot bigger neck, a lot wider, you can see like collarbones and... Upper chest and stuff. If you go to the gym and you like tighter t-shirts, this one could be for you, but... I don't like t-shirts this tight anymore. This is, I think it's like trying too hard, you know what I mean? Like, you don't need to wear t-shirts this tight, even if you do go to the gym. Like, you just need one that is a nice fit, that is not too tight, because, like I said, it's just like you're trying too hard. Not a bad t-shirt, the quality feels nice, nice and stretchy, which is good, just a bit too tight. Third t-shirt is from Sulfit Clothing, my own brand. This one is 12 pounds, size large again. This for me is basically the perfect fit. So it's a nice heavy cotton. It's just cotton, there's no stretch in it, which I do kind of like. It's gonna shrink a tiny bit in the wash, but not too much. I think it's really nice on the arms and the sleeves, good length, like not too tight, but it is fitted. It's quite slim fitted. Minimal branding as well. I've designed this one, so it is a really nice t-shirt. It's only 12 quid as well. But yeah, this is my favorite definitely so far. This is why I've designed it because I've already tried all these on over the years, you know what I mean? I'm trying to perfect the t-shirt. So if you do want to check anything out from Sulfur, it's gonna be linked in the description. Make sure you go and have a look, like really comfy clothes, nice fitting, get involved. Fourth t-shirt is from Jack and Jones. This is actually like a bit of a different material. It's like a peak cotton which is what you'd usually get on like a polo shirt. This is actually a really nice fit, you know, like the length is good, it's nice on the arms, it's not too tight, it's got a bit of a roll in the sleeves as well. I could maybe size up to an XL, then it'd probably be like the perfect fit. Definitely in some of these I need to size up to an XL because some sizes do definitely run small, which is, you only really find out from trying stuff on, don't you? So I hope this video helps you in that sense, but yeah, I'd probably size up. It's a nice t-shirt, fits well. I think this one is 15 quid, but I'll put it on the screen for you anyway. So this one says the perfect T. We'll see about that. All right, so in the collar, this one says it's the perfect T. And in my opinion, it's far from it. So it's from Selected Home. I think this one is 18 pounds, but I'll put it on the screen anyway. It's just way too tight, guys. Like, have you seen how tight this fit is? It's not ideal at all. The cotton feels nice quality, but it's too short on the body as well. It's really short and it's just tight everywhere. And there's no, unlike the Bershka one, which has stretch in it, this one doesn't have any stretch either. So it's definitely not the perfect tee. That's why I've made this video like, you can get some that think they're the perfect tee, but they're honestly not. So I wouldn't go for this at all, guys. 
All right, so we're getting into more of the designer brands now. This one is Tommy Hilfiger, the little minimal logo. This one is 22 pounds, size large again. Like I said, I think I'd have to size up for this one because the t-shirts run really small. Um, it's really short on my body. I don't, you can't really properly see, but if you're over six foot, it's gonna be short on your body and just a bit tight like around the chest, shoulders and arms. So if I got an XL, it would be fine. Um, the quality feels okay, like it doesn't feel the best quality. Um, 22 quid, Tommy Hilfiger. I do really like the minimal branding, the tiny logo. I think it does look pretty sick to be honest, guys. It's quite a nice tee, it's just a bit too small. All right, so guys, a seventh t-shirt is from a brand called Lyle and Scott. It's got this really nice gold logo on it here. The fit of this one is absolutely banging. It's really, really nice. Other than the sulfate clothing one, this is probably the best fitting one in here. I think the quality is really nice as well. You can tell it's like a really nice, high quality blend of cotton. Feels really nice. The length is spot on on the body for me. It's nice on the arms, nice around the shoulders and chest. This is spot on. Really nice fit, it's not too tight either. All right guys, the second to last t-shirt is from a brand called Original Penguin. It's got a little penguin logo here. This one is 25 pounds again. It's very similar to the Lyle and Scott one, but just a bit of a tighter fit. So the quality of the cotton feels very similar, like nice and heavy, really good quality, but it's definitely a bit tighter, like around the arms, the chest, a little bit shorter as well in the body. So the Lyle and Scott one is just basically a better version of this one. So I'd definitely go for the Lyle and Scott, both 25 quid. Very similar. All right guys, last but not least, we have got one from Ralph Lauren. The most expensive one here, I think this one is 45 quid. And to be honest, it's probably the worst fit here. Out of all these, it's the most expensive and it's the worst fit. Like, look how short it is in the body. So short, I'd at least have to get an XL. It's really like tight and small around the chest and upper body as well the asos one is a better fit and it's six quid yeah the quality feels nice the logo is really nice the branding's good but just make sure you size up if you are going to get one from ralph Lauren because the sizes run really small all right let's do a recap i'll give you my top three out of this bunch so guys to recap on all the t-shirts if i was having to pick three out of the whole bunch I'd probably go for Lyle and Scott, Sulphur Clothing, and Jack and Jones. They're my top three. Like, if you want one that is a little bit more expensive, really high quality, really nice heavy cotton with a decent fit, go for the Lyle and Scott one. Really nice, pure white colour, really good quality. It's probably going to last you quite a while, 25 quid. It's actually not even that bad, really. If you want one that is a little bit cheaper, I would definitely go for... Sulfit clothing or Jack and Jones just depends like what sort of material you like. This is more of like a polo shirt material and then this is like a normal t-shirt material. But again, 12 quid, 15 quid, both really nice t-shirts. I would just size up in this one, but this one is true to size. So guys, that is going to wrap up the video. I hope you found it a little bit helpful. If you're in the market to get a white t-shirt, I'm sure this has helped you out a little bit. But it's just mad how like you can spend 45 quid on a t-shirt like from Ralph Lauren and it just be such a bad fit. Like, that's just not ideal that at all is it so definitely size up if you are going to get from ralph Lauren. especially i think that's a custom slim fit but yeah if you want to see more videos like this guys don't forget to drop it a like subscribe to the channel if you've not already and i'm going to link all the t-shirts in the description thanks for watching i'll catch you on the next one see you later